what's good killers it's your boy b man the fucking killer i'm back with another video for you guys sorry if i sound a little weird i'm a little bit under the weather got some stuff going on but i wanted to drop a really quick video in regards to some final fantasy news i myself have played final fantasy on the channel so before we hop into it make sure you like comment subscribe if you want to roll to 1k Killy kill again, you know how the fuck we do, man. Let's hop into the video. There's only one thing we say it's do. Final Fantasy 7 Remake PS5 Save Transfer included a new update. So it says Final Fantasy 7 Remake PS5 Save Transfers are not available thanks to the new update in place for the integrated new gen enhancements. This means that those that enjoyed the modernized take on the Final Fantasy favorite can now enjoy the tell on the new generation of gaming without having to start from scratch. When players boot up Final Fantasy 7 Remake, they'll see a new option added to the game's menu. Is there? It is there a new choice that has been added of those upload save data option. Click on that and you will choose to save file on your choosing to upload to be directly downloaded from your PS5 system specifically for integrate. For those that may have had several runs, you're not just limited to just one save file either. But what about trophies? No worries. Trophy data, which is not uncommon, will also transfer over for integrate. Players will see all the new features that Final Fantasy VII Remake Integrate has on PS5 when the, P when the game releases on June 10th. This also includes the brand new Yuffie episode, which is, is exclusive to PS5. It will bring in more familiar faces to the remake for a long time fans to enjoy. Save transfers are hit and miss with this gen. It seems that some games offer right at the gate. Other studios say it's not. It's just not possible. That being said, PlayStation 5 consoles are still very much hard to come by, and Sony has updated gamers so that shortage won't be any anytime soon. So, with this information, this is good. We're finally getting uh, the transfer data to the new gen consoles which is good because for a while now for some of those who are ps5 users was not able to buy the dlc unless you were buying it i guess on the next gen console entirely as a whole which i bought it on ps4 i was not able to get it but with this update i should be able to buy it now um, I haven't checked it out, but if it's going to be on PS5 enhancements now and all the updated and everything like that, you should be Let's good. Go. Yeah, this is good information. Let's this is go. good to know. I'm excited. I did know that the new DLC is coming out June 10th, which is crazy. That's a Thursday. And then the Let's day go. after that is going to be the Kakarot DLC for the Trump's Future of Hope. So, we have a, we have some, some nice go. stuff coming out next week. So, Let's go. Um, with that being said, let me know you guys' thoughts about it uh, down in the comments down below. I don't really have too much to say. It's pretty much self-explanatory in the uh, article, which I will have in the description down below if you want to read without my commentary. So, you know what I'm saying? Without further ado, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video. Um, once again, my apologies. I'm a little under the weather, but, you know, I, I still try to drop content when I can, but, you know, I just got to get better. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next video. Kill it out.